Hello YouTube. So today, um, I'm actually keeping my voice a little down because I'm in I'm in my school, but it doesn't matter. So basically, I'm going to show you how to use um, Find My iPhone if you ever lose or do anything to your iPod or iPhone. So I'm going to go. Where's the mouse right there? I'm going to go into Google Chrome. Type in Find My iPhone. Alright, and let's do the first one right there. And then click an i uh, no, never. Find my iPhone. Ah, here it is, find your miss. Ah, here we go, iCloud stuff. Okay. So then I'm gonna sign in. I'm gonna come right back, sorry guys. Alright, and I am back. And he, let me just go back to home. So here's when you log into iCloud, here's what it is. I'm gonna do that one, which is find my iPhone. If I can find the mouse, there it is. Alright, and so basically what you wanna do is all devices here, what's this? I don't know what that is. And then that is my iPod, and then and also another note for this to work. Let me just put into for this to work, you at least have to have like an internet connection or like at least like um, location services on. If you don't know that is Google search it and then come back to this. And then so I can lo lo uh, I can erase it. I can lost mode it. I can play sound. I refresh and right now I am I am right now at my school, which is new to North High School. And so, that is my iPod right there. It has recognized it right there. And so, yeah, once you play Lost Sound, I'm not going to actually do it because I might cut it off. So you can play it, you can, like, turn it, turn, like, uh, lock it off, or you can fully erase it. And so, yeah, that's basically all. And then, if you, if you synced it up to your computer and all of that, you can also, like, find your mail, your contacts, your your calendar, your photos, and all that stuff. So yeah, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.